like I was saying before, we are doing the Volt. We're teaming up with street parking. If you have never heard of street parking, they do daily workouts. And then they do something called the Vault, which is 25 weeks long. And once a week, we're going to be doing one of their workouts. It's a CrossFit-based workout. And once you get done with those 25 weeks, you don't have to do it live. You can do it on demand as well, but you do have to do it within the week. If you don't get it done within the week, then you don't get the t-shirt. <laughs> so at the end of the 25 weeks, there is a branded t-shirt that we're working with Street Parking to create for Street Parking and SK training. So you'll earn that if you finish all of the workouts. And again, it has to be done within that week. If you're on vacation, if you're sick, if anything, you got to get done within that week. You can modify. There are ways to modify the workouts as well, but they got to get done. Got to touch on center overhead. So today we will be doing the vault. Touch your toes, squat down, hips up, and stand up. It's not a long workout. The workouts are never long but they are hard. So we'll do warm up, we'll do the workout, we'll do a cool down, and then we'll call it a day, a day. Whether it's a 30 minute workout, a 10 minute workout, that's what the consistency will be. I won't tap on anything else onto the workouts. Arms swing forward because the workouts are hard enough. If you're pushing yourself, you won't have much left in your tank after you finish the vault. Good, take it back. And don't worry if you missed anything, I will send this all out in an email later. Good, over and under. And side to side. Really key notes. For 25 weeks, we are doing one workout from street parking. After the 25 weeks, you get to earn a t-shirt, which I love. Uh, 10 legs move forward, 10 across. Five inch worms. Stretch out whenever you need to. Shake it out a little bit. Okay, a couple things here. Recommended weight for today's workout, 25 pound dumbbells. Um, you do not have to use 25 pound dumbbells, but I do want you to record what weight you are using for today. Okay, so whatever weight you are using, record that. We're doing thrusters and devil presses. So for you to score one round, it's going to be 15 unbroken, 15 unbroken thrusters. So remember thrusters sit right here, squat down, up overhead, squat down, up overhead. So if you drop them here and you stop, then that is, that's a broken one. So it doesn't count. So make sure that you grab a weight 
where you feel comfortable going for 15 without stopping. If you do want to rest during that round, you can rest, but your weights have to be up overhead. And that sucks. So don't do that. <laughs> Just find a weight that's going to work for you for 15 of them. So 15 unbroken is one round. And then after that, in order to start the next round, you have to do five devil presses. Okay. So those devil presses right here, just like a burpee right here, up, bring the weight up overhead, back down. Okay. So down, up, overhead, back down. Those are devil presses. Again, 15 thrusters unbroken. So you don't stop, you don't rest, knock out the 15. That will give you one round. Goal is four to six rounds. Okay. It's only a 10 minute AMRAP. Any questions? So you can, so you rest, can rest after, after you do the five. Yes. Yeah. Okay. You can rest before you start that next round. But remember, this is only a 10 minute AMRAP. So for you to hit the goal, uh, four to six rounds, you're pretty much going to have to be going nonstop here. Okay. So choose wisely where you're resting, how long you're resting, record what you're doing. So make sure that you have something where you can just record like a check for which round you're on, because it's going to go quickly. Check off. Um, here's the thing too. If you, if you rest while you're doing those thrusters at any time, like if you're just sitting here like this, that's, that's rest time. It doesn't count. That means that whole round does not count and you have to start it over. But you don't have to start the demo presses over. So if you stop to rest, that round doesn't count. You have to start the thrusters over, but don't start with the devil presses first, okay? Cool. Everybody pretty confident in these movements? Yeah, okay. So 15 to five, okay? You don't get to start the next round until those five double presses are done. These need to be unbroken. You have a 10 minute AMRAP here. Record where you're at, how you're doing. Um, if you guys, no, it doesn't matter because it's an AMRA. Okay, cool. All right, let me grab a board for myself too. Okay. I want to make sure because I'll forget where I'm at. Welcome to the suck, guys. <laughs> Here we go. Let me make sure we got this right before we start it. So the good news is that you're here for this workout, so you don't have to make it up anytime during the week. Whoever didn't show up today, they will have to make it up. Okay. I'm going to start some music first so that we're not just staring at each other, and then I'm going to start the timer. So you have just a minute. If you need to grab water, go ahead and do that now. I wasn't going to play the music because so I was going to have my headphones in, but that's not working for us today. All right, here we go. 10 minute AMRAP, remember, unbroken here. Let me start my timer, I'll tell you when. All right, it's counting down from 10. Let's go.
for a little bit like under eight.
Take a break, grab some water. Okay. Make sure you record and send it to me. How many, what weight you used, how many completed rounds you did, and then whatever you did after. So if there was like, I did 10 thrusters at the very end, if you did, um, the devil presses at the end, but didn't make it to the next round. Just record all that and send it on over. Um, whew, let's cool down. One arm across at the beginning of the next week for each week. I'll send you guys what to expect for that following week, some modifications that you can include. And then we'll put the leaderboard, which isn't really a leaderboard, it's you against you. So but we'll put up the results so people can kind of gauge where, where they're at, where they want to be. Oh, arm overhead. How are you guys feeling? Good, worked. Good, switch sides. Again, like I said, I won't add anything to these workouts. We don't need to. Let's reach down for those toes, change the chest. Good, slow roll up. Whew. Let's go arm swings forward. I'll send you guys what to expect for that next week. And then a little bit about what we did today. You guys did awesome today. All right, over and under. Some of your results. Even if you do the on-demand, I still want the results just so that I can track that you are doing it and you did do it. So send me them, even if you choose to do the on-demand option. All right, any questions? Good, how are you guys feeling? Okay, 
You guys are just like, <laughs> no, no, that was a good, that was, that was a good plan. Good. So for 25 weeks, once a week, we will be doing this. Okay. If you make it to the end of those 25 weeks, you earn a shirt. So you'll earn a shirt that's branded with street parking and SK training. Thank you for showing up today. I know you guys were expecting a lower body workout. I'm sure your quads are feeling oh, it. Oh, no. so. fine, fine. <laughs> Good. All right. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.